six. Howard out of the gun. Chased into the end zone, got rid of it, knocked down, and nearly intercepted up front by Hardrick Walker. The nose tackle. Each offense with a three and out to start. Great field position to begin this series for the Aggies. Kyle Allen chase. Now finds a man wide open, caught. Josh Reynolds, touchdown. A 44-yard hookup, and that's a record center for Reynolds. His 13th touchdown grab of the year. From the defense. Josh Reynolds, the junior college transfer. As Skyler Howard takes a shot deep, man wide open, standing at midfield and hauling it in is Jordan Thompson on third down at the Mountaineers. Howard sets, throws over the middle, and a big hit. And a penalty flag comes up. This could be targeting on Matthews. This will be huge, too. Matthews is a guy they need in the back end. He's their senior leader. Out of the hold of Michael Molinari. And West Virginia is on the board. Well, none of my records are going to get broken. Let's just say that. <laughs> Howard, four of eight, 42 yards passing, throws it out into the flat for Alford here, who can create after the catch. And he does. The 10 stays on his feet into the end zone for a touchdown. The little receiver puts up big numbers of 40. Aggie's back on offense. The true freshman has it intercepted. K.J. Dillon dives. Did he get in? Yes, touchdown. K.J. Dillon. Own 40-yard line. Under three minutes to go here in the opening quarter. Trey Carson. Going to try that side of the field again. He's got a first down and more into West Virginia territory. The biggest running back in that Texas A&M stable. But they're bringing six or seven sometimes. And they're getting ready to bring it again, Clay. And you see Tony Gibson actually, it looks like he's taking it off and saying play. Spavadol going for it on fourth down. Bobbled. Now a man open caught. Trey Williams. Got behind the secondary and scores. That aggressive defense for West Virginia sometimes gets out over its skis, and they did this. Yes. Howard stepping up in the pocket, wants to run. There's that dual threat ability you've been talking about, Anthony. And we're seeing it really for the first time on that play. Going deep this time for Jordan Thompson. Penalty flags again. Thompson somehow in that double coverage made the catch at the 29-yard line. And that's right on the screws. 20 to 14 West Virginia leading. Just was a little much for the maturity and the growth for this team in the hole. On second and six. Caught at the 35 by Kennedy. Travis. Sat in, but understandable as Texas A&M has it in the red zone, and now they're in the end zone. Malcolm Kennedy, the touchdown catch from Kyle Allen, his second touchdown pass. Flags come out at the end. So watch uh, his old teammates, Florida State, take on the Ducks. This is Skyler Howard going deep downfield. Caught. Touchdown, Kevin White. A 50-yard touchdown pass. As White got behind the Shazer for Texas A&M down the stretch in the season as Trey Williams right there. Another big penalty for West Virginia. End around on the 10th play of this drive. Well covered by Texas A&M. Jordan Thompson had nowhere to go. And there is Miles Garrett making a nice play for the game. Second and 23 and Howard is sacked. Miles Garrett and Tommy Sanders. And another sack for Garrett on his 19th birthday that he's celebrating here today. Coaching for the last few years. Trey Carson has a first down carry. Penalties have become a real storyline in this football game. And a run for Williams. He's got the first down. And he's got it at the 40 yard line Second for Texas. And eight here. Allen out of the gun, backing up. Throws it, screen to Trey Carson. He's got a first down and more. Down to the 17-yard line. Dylan and Joseph finally get a chance to take the lead back. 
But in trouble here is Allen on the 12th play. Gets away. First down. And he dives for the pylon. Did he step out? No. Touchdown. What a great job by the freshman Allen to stay in bounds and score from 14 yards out. He flushes out. He creates. He just spins around. Nobody's the home pressure. to contain. Off the passing game. Howard chased out of the pocket. Got rid of it. And there is a penalty flag out there. Deshaun Hall had him in the grasp, and I think this is going to be intentional. And penalties, a huge factor in this game, including straight bowl game here today. That would be a program record. They're in their sixth straight bowl overall as Carson gets into the second level, gets out of a couple of tackles, and takes it to the 16. Daryl Worley, the quarterback, finally. The Aggies add to their lead. Skyler Howard pressure off his back foot. Incomplete. No one even close. Need to get the ball in their hands. Caught. Shell. And he is planted at the 15. DeShazer Everett, the captain of the Aggies defense, decletes the receiver. Now, young kids watching this game, this is textbook tackling right here. Watch the positioning, shoulder around the waist. He really proved himself in that Auburn win on the road earlier this season. Nice run after the catch. A quick rise and a quick fall for the young man, and obviously paid dearly for some of the mistakes, and he's got to come back and fight back for his position because Kyle Allen right now is leading the team. The half for the Aggies, they got a field goal on the last series. Third down at 20, Allen. Sidesteps a tackle, throwing on the run, has a man caught. At the 18-yard line, a pretty pass and catch for the first down. Ricky Seals-Jones with his first reception of the day, give him 22. Yeah, you see him get outside, and Ricky Seals-Jones is putting his arm up. Big 6'5", red shirt freshman. This young man's got stars written all over him. A lot of young receivers that are going to be big-time receivers in a couple years. Williams bouncing to the outside, gets free, and gets to the end zone. What a run for Trey Williams. Touchdown, Aggies. Well, when you watch these running backs, and I said it earlier, this guy is fast and quick, and he can make big plays, and you got to get touches for this kid. And you see the quickness, his ability to get, make defenders make. Third down and one. Howard launching it deep down the middle of the field, and it's caught by White. Kevin White, the All-American, down to the 21-yard line. time he'll go in motion. They hand it off for Shell, and he is whipped out at the 15-yard line. Great play by the Texas A&M defense, led by Donovan Wilson, the strong safety. Hey, that... A tip of the back to losses to end the regular season. Here's Trey Carson. Wow, lowers the shoulder, gets an extra oh, yard. It should be a first down. Yeah. They fake it to Williams. Throwing is Allen. Caught. First down to the 32-yard line, Josh Reynolds. Third down Williams. average today for a &M, Six yards to go. Allen takes off. He's got a lane for the first down and slides to the 19. Got Pop doing it. But again, they'll move the sticks. Kyle. And another long drive here for Texas A&M. Throw into the end zone. Looking for Kennedy, and he got it. Check that. <laughs> Kyle Allen hits Malcolm Kennedy. Touchdown, Texas A&M. A&M's hands. Second and ten. Here they do run it with Shell. Stiff arm, but what a great play defensively by Everett. He swatted that stiff arm away, stuck with Shell. He's just not on target. White stays on his feet. Ball comes out. Still loose, and now it looks like AM has recovered. Devontae Harris comes up with the football. Tommy Sanders knocked it loose. Still lives in College Station on the trip here, celebrating with the fans. And Skyler Howard is taken down by Tommy Sanders. That's a loss of four as this defense now, which is the 32-yard line first down for West Virginia, down 15. Howard going deep down the field. Contact. 
And that is a catch. Shelton Gibson, just his fourth catch this year. Eighth play of the series. That's thrown behind the receiver. Dakeel Shorts. Watts was in on the... He's been a backup guard, a backup center, a tight end, an H-back. Here's Trey Williams into the secondary. Got out of a couple of tackles and gets across the 45-yard line. Again, Trey Williams showing his ability to stay nice Virginia back with little time to do it in. Good run here for Smallwood. Inside the 10, down to the 4-yard line. What a run for Wendell. Howard rolling out. Caught. Touchdown, Mountaineers. Looking to get to the 35. Got it. First down, Malcolm Kennedy. The true freshman goes to the sure-handed senior for that critical pickup. Yeah, it's man-to-man -man across, and they left space for Malcolm Kennedy here. And listen, talk about making a big play, defining moments in your career. That's a tough catch, folks. Don't take any catch or any ball for granted. That senior right there, Kennedy, showing you the reason why he was the leader of this receiving core. And these young guys around him, Seals Jones, Reynolds, Noyle, these guys can learn right from there, closing the deal and getting that first down. Yeah, the only to win and finish. Today they finish the game in, in great fashion. And that's going to do it as Allen sprints back. It's a 45-37 win for Texas A&M. They're the AutoZone Liberty Bowl champions for 2014. For Don Davenport, Anthony Beck, Don Clay Matvick. Next on ESPN, more Bowl Mania, the Russell Athletic Bowl.